Um, hi guys. I'm sorry I haven't posted in a while. I'm sick. And I'm still a little bit sick. Just a little bit. And, um, I also sprained my ankle. It's really swollen. I did it marching for marching band. I actually, funny story. I was dizzy to start with, and you have like a step about that big. About that big, you have to get over. And my band decided to randomly turn. And I'm like second in line, so it's like I had no warning. I just, it was just bam, turn. And I stepped on the soft dirt, and I kind of just, one second I was up in attention, and the next I'm on the floor. Whole band died laughing. I'm sitting there, I'm like, I can't get up. My ankle's twisted, it hurt. I was crying from laughing, 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 and um, it was pretty funny actually, but I also got made fun of today for that, because we went out marching again. But I got up, and I kept marching, and I was proud of myself. Yes sir, yes sir. Do you know how hard it is to do that? Very hard. <laughs> March on a sprained ankle. And I roll step, too. That's really hard. Um, anyways, yeah. So, I'm going to teach you all who help, I'm sure. I had somebody tell me that they had one without a mouth plate. Those are the harder ones, guys. They're most likely wooden, and it's really, really hard to play. I actually learned on that first, which made this so much easier. So, if you have a non mouth plate one, kudos. It'll take a while. Get close up on this mouth situation. Pick low head joint. Yes, Lauren, what do you want? I'm doing pick of the picks. I'm just observing. My <laughs> Again. Shut up. Because she's fascinated with the flute. She wants to learn. Oh, yes. No, I don't. Shut up. I love my clarinet. Shut up. And anyway, this is the mouth plate. And your mouth plate is your best friend. Um, to get a proper embouchure, you want to act like you are blowing into a water bottle. I mean, as kids, we've all done it. You go, when you blow down. Well, you do the same with the piccolo and the flute. Um, you want to put your bottom lip on it, and you put the very end at the very beginning of the hole. Like that. And then you put your lips together and roll up. The top lip right here, that top part, has to match that. And then you just blow. That's actually fun. <laughs> And, um, let's see. You always want to roll out before you play. Like, if you don't a flute, roll out, roll out, roll out, roll out. Roll it. <laughs> you, like, violated my piccolo. Um, If you hear that sound, it means there's not enough air. Not me. Okay. That means that it is not enough air. Not enough air means you can't make a note. You want to make a note. If you have that noise, you blew too hard. You're not trying to blow all your air into it. You want to moderate the air. You blow exactly like you're blowing to a flute. That actually was a good sound for a lot of air. Okay. Oh no. You have like a twitch.
fuck is that? <laughs> I don't know. Um, that was not enough air, obviously. You heard the little scratchy sound. Alright, and when you first start playing, you're also not going to have a lot of lung support, obviously, because it's a lot different from the flute. So, get away. You made your cameo. Get away. So, you, you will get better at learning how to play longer notes, at learning how to play as more notes with one breath. Like, you will get better. I guarantee you. Everybody does. And, hmm, if you don't have a mouth plate and you just have the hole, you basically just, you really want to make sure you're rolling. You really want to make sure you're rolling. Rolling when you don't have a mouth plate is your best friend. It is. Because it ensures that you have your mouth positioned correctly. If you have it too far up, it makes that weird noise. And that's not a regular noise. It also makes it sharper. You go too far back, too far back. You can't even get a sound out of it. And you want a sound out of your piccolo. Um, anyways, I hope I answered your questions. If not, comment and... I will, I guess, post a video response answering the questions. Um, thanks. I love you. Bye.